Now, when a virus comes along that's spreading like a plague, and POTUS and his lackeys have been nothing if not vague, well then you've got to trust the CDC and listen well, unless you want to bid our free society farewell. There is a super bad transmittable contagious awful virus and if we don't act quick and social distance it will mire us in a stretch of quarantine that lasts until july a super bad transmittable contagious awful virus and if you got a better cough in your arm and if you got a better <coughs> now back in 1918 influenza had its run but half the docks were busy overseas with world war one today we have mass media and scientists to say if you don't want this virus well then stay six feet away super damn important that we practice isolation cause we're asymptomatic while it's an incubation will overwhelm our hospitals if there's not mitigation it's super damn important that we practice isolation if we don't do it then we're all gonna die if we don't do it then we're all gonna die and so i hope at last you'll take this lesson here to heart cause it's already scary and we're only at the start if you get bored just think of the immunocompromised who can't go much of anywhere unless it's sterilized oh super bad transmittable contagious awful virus if we don't act quick and social distance it will mire us in a stretch of quarantine the last until july a super bad transmittable Super bad, transmittable, contagious, awful virus. Super bad, transmittable, contagious, awful virus. Okay, the last part was pretty real high, but um, super bad transmissible contagious of a virus is a very hard word to say. Try it at home, uh, it's gonna be a bit hard. Uh, try to say it in your first try, and very fast. Super bad transmissible The word transmittable is like, um, the and contagious is probably the words that kind of miss people a lot when they're saying it. So super bad trans, because it was a super bad awful virus would be easy, but they had to add, it's, it's supposed to be a parody of super colorful expialidocious. I love that super colorful expialidocious because it's really fun to say, but some people can't say it really sad. <laughs> so, super colorful super colorful expialidocious. Um, super bad, transmittable, contagious, awful viruses. Yeah. So, um, this um, song talks about um, you should listen to the news. And so, you listen to the news, trust the news, not the fake news. Um, listen to what they say and how to protect yourself from the virus. And always. <laughs> Well, there's just so much to look forward to. Tune in in a month's time. We will bring you the Disney magic from outer space. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, Happiest People on Space. Turn on your notifications so you can get reminded a month from now when we show you the premiere video of the Happiest People on Space. We also have our Facebook page, our Twitter account, and our Instagram. Give us a follow and some likes and plot on your calendar June 13th, 2020. It's a Saturday. Of course we'll start posting daily vlogs starting today. So expect another video tomorrow and the day after and the next and to infinity and beyond. So June 13th the gates will open. We'll bring you in fascination the wonderful world of Space Disney with the happiest people on space. That's exactly three months from when Disneyland Resort and Disney's California Adventure has closed indefinitely. Remember when it was? March 13th, 2020. It's on a Friday. Coronavirus fallout and closing of Disneyland. 
I don't even know what I'm doing with myself anymore. So, see you tomorrow. Hasta mañana. Makita te out ulit Goodbye.